What's going on guys, 3D Print Dude here. In today's video, I wanna talk about a comparison between two 3D printers, the Bamboo Lab P1P and the Bamboo Lab P1S. These are closely related 3D printers, but there's a couple main differences that you need to know. So let's break this down so you can decide which one to get. So the big question at stake here is, what's the main difference between the P1P and the P1S? The P1S is essentially an enclosed version of the P1P. It comes with an auxiliary and chamber fan, and it also has a fan for the main circuit board to prevent overheating when the printer is enclosed. These fans are crucial for maintaining optimal temperatures inside the enclosure, can significantly impact the quality and reliability of your prints. Besides these additions, the core functionality and performance of both printers are pretty much the same. If you're curious about the specific upgrades, you can check out the P1P to P1S upgrade kit in the bamboo accessory section, which details all the parts that are enhanced in the P1S. And again, I'll throw all the links in the description if you're looking to take a closer look. Now let's talk about user experiences between these two printers. People have shared that they initially bought a P1P printer, but eventually decided to sell it and get the P1S. The main reason was the enclosure. Maybe they live in places where temperatures fluctuate due to air conditioning or open windows, and having an enclosed printer like the P1S provided a more stable environment for printing. This stability is especially beneficial if you plan to print with materials that require controlled temperatures, like such prints and materials like ABS, PETG, etc. While they primarily printed with PLA on the P1P without any issues, the P1S gave them peace of mind and the flexibility to explore new materials confidently. In summary, both the P1P and P1S are excellent 3D printers that will serve same fundamental purpose and produce high quality prints. The P1S stands out because of its enclosure and additional cooling features which can be crucial if you plan to print with a variety of materials that require a more controlled environment. If you're just starting out and budget is a concern, the P1P is a solid choice that can grow with you. But if you want to future-proof your setup and have a bit more flexibility and convenience right from the start, the P1S is the way to go. I hope this helps you make an informed decision on which Bamboo Lab 3D printer to choose. If you have any questions or want to share your experience, drop a comment below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on any upcoming videos. Thanks for watching and happy printing, guys.